In this demo, I'm going to show you how to connect to a Cloud SQL database using the Google Cloud SDK and the G Cloud command line interface. So in the last demo, we created this MySQL database using Cloud SQL. Now, if we click on that, that'll take us to the details page. And if we scroll down a little bit, there's a little section here on connecting to this instance. Now, just a couple notes. Right here, it's showing you the public IP address of the virtual machine that is running your database server. And then right here, it's showing you the connection name that you can use to connect to that server. So depending on the software you're using or the tools you're using, you might need to know that when connecting to the database. And there's also this choice down here, connect using Cloud Shell. Now let's click on that and that's gonna open up Cloud Shell and it's gonna show us the G Cloud command that we can use to connect to the database. So notice it's G Cloud, SQL, connect. This is the name of my database and I'm gonna connect as the user root and dash dash quiet. That just means don't ask me anything, just do it. All right, so let's hit enter. Now notice this error. Don't panic if you see this error. I'm in a brand new project that I've created and I've never tried to make this Cloud SQL connection before. So it's telling me right here, the Cloud SQL Admin API has not been used and it's dis disabled. So you're gonna have to enable it before you can run this command. And it's giving us a hyperlink right here that will allow us to enable that API. So let's click on that link. So that brings us to this web page, and it's allowing us to enable the Cloud SQL Admin API. So let's just click there, enable. Okay, so now we're enabled. So let's go back to Cloud Shell and let's try our command again. Now where do you see this? Allow whitelisting your IP for incoming connections. What's going on there is that when you create a Cloud SQL database, Google puts that database in a network that they manage. And when you want to connect to that database from another machine, a firewall rule has to be created that allows that machine to get to the database. By default, nothing can access that network until the firewall gets open. So we're trying to make that connection here. So we just got to give Google a minute to create that firewall rule. And then here it's saying, now we've gotten through, so it's saying I'm connecting to your database with root. You got to give me your password. And if you if you watched the last video, in the last video we generated a password that we can use for root to connect the first time. And I stored that in a text file temporarily. So let's go back to that and copy and paste that password here and click enter. And now we're in. And notice we're at a MySQL client, and I guess we could start typing some database commands. So there we go. Anyway, that's how you connect to a Cloud SQL database using the Google Cloud SDK and the G Cloud command line interface. This is Doug Renstrom with ROI Training.